Fred's old 395 grill is the last place I expected to hear Millie Vanilli on the radio. But here we are. Planet on the rain. Something or other tour, we're at Red's Old 395 Grill in Carson City, Nevada. It's right on Highway 395, hence the name. You guys get it, right? Do the math. <laughs> it's a really cool themed restaurant, has a bunch of artifacts and stuff like that. I was in town, figured I should stop by, check it out. A couple people have requested that we do more like food episodes or restaurants and stuff, so uh, I thought this would be cool. Let's go check it out. This place is so cool. Wow. This place is tried and true. Huh? All kinds of awards. We have this lovely young lady looking over our table. This menu is crazy. There's so much stuff in it. It's almost like whatever you can think. It's a smorgasbord. They got wings, they got nachos, they got kick-ass chili apparently, steaks, pork chops, seafood, salmon, uh, personal pizzas, stuffed chicken breast. It's kind of overwhelming. There's so much stuff in here. And they have a wine list. They also have a martini menu and a beer menu. Now this place is known because apparently it has like a hundred plus beers. I don't drink, so I won't partake, but if you're a beer drinker, this might be the place for you. It's cool that each menu seems to have different artwork on it. I like the airplane one. Is it the Wright Brothers? I don't know, something like it. start it's interesting instead of bowls they have like tostada not tostada it's like taco shell bowls we both got the beef brisket sandwich it looks pretty incredible on a french roll let's see mm. Mm -hmm. makes you want to do a dance that makes you want to dance that's good huh I like that. Ooh. Beans and beef. Mm. Potato? Oh, are you mixing that? Mm. Oh. For my sides, I got garlic mash and au gratin potatoes. It's very good already. I'm gonna try a little more of this barbecue sauce though. Extra sauce, the magic. Ooh, that garlic mash is good. Steamroll. 
originally from New York, this thing helped pave Wall Street. Maybe you shouldn't have. <laughs> That's cool, they put the LEDs in there so it looks like it's actually burning coal. Wahoo! I knew the robot. Look at that, I almost missed it. This place is filled with cool artifacts. Apparently the owners would go around to different auctions and just buy things from all over the country. This is the Churchill Room, constructed of 100% Honduran mahogany. And they have cigars here too, of course, hence the name. Up above the bar is the Fire Steam Water Pumper. Built by a company in France, it ended up in Waco, Texas. Now it's here in Carson City, above the bar. Up on the wall, they say that's a collection of over a thousand different beer bottles. And they claim it was drunk by one person. I don't know. Huh. Full blown tower outside a restaurant. Crazy. really wagons glow around this place. <laughs> I've no idea what this is, but it looks like some sort of serving window right under the motel sign here. What are those things? Any farmers out there? Or some sort of mining? I don't know. I thought it was like old flintlock pistols and I got excited. <laughs> Shout out to Shy for giving us more info. A lot of this rock, I'm not sure all of it or just some of it, was extracted back in 1860 from the hills nearby. Watch for rattlers, kids. Huh? Be safe. There's a rocket. Yeah. There's a rocket up there. You see that elbow? I'm a rocket man. This harvester was found on the side of the road in Portland, Maine. Big boy. That two wheel up there was used in Planet of the Apes with Charlton Heston. And there's a ship's figurehead. I don't know the story of it. I sure wish I did. That's a funny gag. I like places with a sense of humor. Apparently this desk came from a San Francisco hotel after the 1906 earthquake. Knock on it for good luck. Shout out Kim. She told me that this is from the St. Francis Hotel. Really cool. This is the assembly room. It's like you can rent it out for events and stuff. 
feels sort of like a private club, like an old gentleman's club. Look at these giant doors. Such cool paintings in this room. Usually they have an info card that actually has a bunch of history about this place and some of the artifacts in here, but they're all out. So, good timing for me, as always. I love badass women like that. <laughs> the rock up here was reclaimed from the debris of the former assembly room. Some of the other rock was used for the Nevada State Prison, which isn't too far from here. <laughs> it's a double safe. I almost walked right by. Oh, that's safe. one actually opens up. This one first. How cool. All right, Reds. That was a heck of a time. Heck of a time. I love after dinner mints. I almost fell over, don't mind me. That's Reds old 395 grill, right here in Carson City, Nevada. Whether you're in Carson City or you're just cruising through on 395, you should stop here. A lot of cool history, a lot of cool artifacts, great food. Like, subscribe, share, do all the cool things that cool kids do. Something or other tour of our life. Huh. Full-blown locomotive cue, huh? What the hell was that? A pickle? <laughs> I just stepped on a pickle. Someone lost their pickle. It's too bad. It's always a shame when people lose their pickles. Um.